So hello, I'm on the roll again. This time we go to Australia and let's see what uh, exciting talk partners I can find there for you. So this is the famous skyline of Melbourne in Australia. And we are lucky in winter having such beautiful weather. I'm here with Dr. Brahim Rabinov, who is a general practitioner with a special interest in nutritional medicine. Brahim, I understand you are involved in the in the board of the Australian Society. What exactly is that? That is the Australasian College of Nutritional Environmental Medicine. I've been a board member for about 15 years and what drove me there was a desire to spread the word because I feel that nutrition plays an enormous role in many conditions and that a lot of the serious conditions that we see in modern day society could be prevented if we were to address our diets. My understanding is that how we function depends on our genes and our environment. And while we can't change our genes, we can influence our environment. And one of the main factors is our nutrition. And I've seen over and over again how nutrition affects people and that interventions can lead to improvement in many, many cases. Okay, Brian, can you actually give me some practical examples where nutritional medicine uh, could play a role in yes. urology in particular? Yes. My experience is that it could play a role in benign prostate megaly, in ca cancer of the prostate, ureteric stones, and problems with uh, male sexual function, in particular erections. It's been strongly demonstrated that metabolic syndrome is very much tied with uh, sexual function. Well, that's very encouraging and I uh, thank you very much for these comments. It is my utter pleasure to deal with you. Thank you. All right.